Good afternoon, third graders. Mr. Johnson wants to have a very quick conversation with the third graders about taking pride in their discussion board posts. These posts are one way for your teachers to really tell if you understand the concepts in reading, writing, and math that we are asking you to complete. So you need to take your time and you need to make sure that you're putting in that proper amount of effort especially for one like you're going to do today where you're going to be asked to type a few sentences to answer. I want to talk about some of the expectations you should hopefully use to help you complete your best work when you're answering this question about poetry this afternoon. One thing is pretty certain. Phrases and one-word answers typically don't fit the questions that your third grade teachers are asking on discussion boards. You need to be a little bit more specific. I'm hoping these examples I share with you today help you understand that so you can put forth your best effort. Your discussion board today is actually going to ask you to describe two ways that poems are usually different from stories. Hmm. If I were to write this answer, they rhyme, does that look like a complete sentence? Does that seem specific enough to explain to someone how poems are different from stories? I think you guys can notice that that doesn't seem like it is a good enough response for the question that's being asked. Now take a look at this response with me. Poems have lines that end with words that rhyme. Stories don't have to use words that rhyme. Notice how this response is two sentences long and gives a clear explanation to explain to the reader of this answer what you are trying to discuss with your response. If a third grade teacher were to read a response like this one from a student, they know that the child understands some of those differences between poetry and stories. So the key third graders is to write those answers that are clear and specific so your teacher knows exactly what you mean in your discussion board response. Now, I gave you one example, don't copy mine. Remember, there are several ways that poetry is different from stories. And you can share two, since your discussion board is going to ask for two today, in the format or the style that Mr. Johnson just shared with you in that last example. Do you think you can handle that? Good luck. Go complete that discussion board now. Have a great afternoon. Thank you.